partners, welcome back to my YouTube channel and today I'll be talking about which of these lotions I think smells unisex. Um, I think um, some of these collections that I or these five can be worn by masculine and I hope these can um, give you pointers while sh you're shopping online because when I was um, buying these lotions I had no idea that these would smell somewhat masculine so now I think um, like these three I can label as um, best unisex and the other two or the other three that are gourmet I can since they smell like food I can also categorize them as unisex so let me start with um, one of the best the sweater weather this actually um, smells like Victoria's Victoria from Victoria's Secret on its um, w when you sniff the bottle but when you start gliding it it smells like um, a soft musky that is very suitable for uh, men as it dries out I, I really like this scent um, it says sun crisp apple which I don't smell in this bottle um, autumn leaves I'm not so sure how would that smell like but yeah the orc orchard woods i it, it, i think um that is the most true scent to describe this one it smells like um woodsy and um a hint of pumpkin and it dries out to be musky next in the list would be um the snowy morning i think this um this scent is very fresh I really love it and you can associate this one with um, Davidoff the cool waters or somewhat blue colognes with this wine it really sm it really smells um, fresh and cool um, at first it doesn't um, really smells very masculine but at it but as it dries as it settles down and dries it smells like um, the blue colognes of masculine blue colognes and it really is very fresh um, I gave this to my brother-in-law and um, he really likes it um, it is um, somewhat for a man maybe with a age 30s to 40s it's not very mature but it's very fresh um, I really really like this um, lotion at first I thought of keeping it but it dries out to be um, masculine and um, overpowering and I think that's very great if you use it here in the Philippines because um, it can I think the scent is um, a very soft fresh durable which I um, which is really good in um, tropical climates so um yeah this one is to check how the, the the originality of the lotion it should never spill if even if you mm, tilt it upside down so yeah i really really like this lotion thumbs up for snowy morning third would be mediterranean blue waters i think um, this lotion is very tropical um, it smells like um, warm coconut and um, since um, in my review, yeah, check my detailed review of this one. It smells like a um, almost sunblock, um, but I think this settles down to like very masculine, um, beachy vibe. So yeah, I gave this to my um, my father, and um, this one, the scent of this one is very durable. It is very ideal here in my place where um, I'm near the beach, and it is very the sun is always up uh, most of the time and um, yeah I would definitely um, recommend that you check my detailed review on this one as I'm very specific of um, how this scent works next are the winter garments of my collection these are Santa's blueberry shortbread Christmas cocoa and mint and hot cocoa and cream I think these three are the best of the winter garments so first I would um, check this Santa Blueberry shortbread and then I'll um, compare the Christmas cocoa and mint and the hot cocoa and cream later. So this um, 
short um, blueberry shortbread um, smells like a a blueberry a blueberry cheesecake drink with um, tapioca balls this can be a soft unisex um, type because it smells like a milk tea a blueberry milk tea with tapioca balls and just because it smells like more like food um, it can be worn by uh, a female or male um, it is, doesn't smell too masculine and not too feminine it doesn't have a um, musky sense on this um, that's what I like with this one because most of um, Bath and Body Works lotions has um, either vanilla, vanilla-ish or mus musky-ish scent and I think this is very unique. I will be having a detailed review with this Santa's Blueberry Shortbread so please check that out as well. The last two gourmet that made um, this list are the hot cocoa and cream and the Christmas cocoa and mint. These two are very chocolatey and very foody scents. Hot cocoa and cream smells like a hot um, chocolate drink, very fluffy. While the Christmas cocoa and mint body lotion, um, when you first apply it, the, uh, I think um, the choco mint explodes on your nose and then it settles like a Milo and it's less overpowering compared to the hot cocoa and cream. So I would come, um, this would also fall into the unisex scents because they smell like food and food can be for everyone. Um, wearing this one you would um, picture someone as um, a very yummy who just got hand on some chocolates and I do highly recommend these two um, some would like the would gravitate more on the hot cocoa and cream but for me I would recommend more the Christmas cocoa and mint from this collection I would recommend um, three first the snowy morning um, I highly recommend this one because it smells very fancy like fine fresh um, cooling blue water scents and this is um, this actually lasts very long some might find it overpowering for girls but um, for uh, for masculine this really works well I tried wearing test this one with um, a male family member and it really works great second in the ranking I would choose sweater weather this um, smells soft musky for men like um, woodsy musk but it's really soft um, but it really works for them um, th th the strength that um, you get when a female wear this one is actually um, is actually mellowed down when a man wears this sweater weather and this is a very um, comfy scent a very cuddly scent last would be third the uh, Christmas cocoa and mint this smells like your favorite chocolate filled mint bars but it settles like a chocolate powder um, I think it might be a, 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 a smell that you can enjoy and this is um, recommendable for younger males the longevity of this Christmas cocoa and mint is weaker compared to the first two the snowy morning and the sweater weather these five um, list of my collection i think are subjective to my preference so um please do, do feel free to comment below to ask um which specific scent you would like to um ask more details about so comment down below if you have questions and interest on specific scents and i'll give you an unbiased opinion with each till then i'll see you in my next video thank you so much for dropping by